Hey, what's up guys? It's Caffeine Burger, and today I wanted to talk about some huge news in Call of Duty as of yesterday. Now, yesterday there was a huge leak on Twitter of the next Call of Duty title called Infinite Warfare. And um, they posted the cover art or um, whatever, the picture of it with the logo and everything on Twitter. And um, it's pretty much confirmed because one of the trusted Call of Duty information sources, Charlie Intel, changed his profile picture from a Black Ops 3 uh, guy to the guy from the Infinite Warfare poster. And um, it's pretty interesting and exciting, and I'm just going to talk about some of my thoughts and uh, what some of the things mean. So first of all, Infinite Warfare seems like a name that could go anywhere, like... Space is infinite, and that is what a lot of people are thinking, plus in the picture, which I'll have these pictures linked down in the description below. I can't put them in the video because of copyright issues, however, I will have them linked. Um, so the guy in the poster is holding a uh, helmet, like a space helmet, and uh, that kind of gives us the idea that it's going to be somewhat in space. And um, he doesn't look too, too futuristic, so maybe it could be a boots on the ground type space I don't really know exactly this is all we can get from the poster but he's holding that and uh, he's walking like kind of towards where the pic poster is being uh, faced towards and um, also above that which is one of the more exciting things there's something that says Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered so this leak or rumor is confirmed um, if you buy one of the editions of Infinite Warfare, pre-order it or whatever, um, you can get Modern Warfare Remastered, and that is going to be amazing. I thought to myself, what if this is even more popular than Infinite Warfare itself, because people want to go back to an older boots-on-the-ground type game, they don't want futuristic, I know it's not like World War II or old times, but it's, it's a nostalgic game for a lot of older Call of Duty players. I never necessarily started with Modern Warfare. I played Black Ops 1 first. That was my first real Call of Duty. Um, but I did go back and I have played some Modern Warfare. And um, I really do like it. Um, I've got, only gotten in a few non-hacked lobbies. So that's kind of a bummer. So that's a good thing that they're remastering it. Also, it says Legacy Edition, which shows um, the Call of Duty Modern Warfare uh, remastered. Originally... Um, my friend S. Gamer or Jordan, whatever you want to call him, told me by Legacy Edition they might mean that this is the last Call of Duty on previous gen consoles, which I'll have another video of that um, this week or so talking about that. But I thought that would not be a good idea because they're trying to get people to all upgrade to the next gen consoles and or current gen and um, not play the last gen consoles. So as well as it comes with Modern Warfare, so I feel like Legacy Edition means that it's coming with Modern Warfare from the remastered rather than going back on previous gen consoles. So that is really awesome news. I hope we get more information soon and it looks promising and um, I think they did a right, the right thing this time, Infinity Ward, but uh, maybe even COD 4 be more popular than uh, this game in infinite warfare itself who knows it'd be kind of ex interesting to see but hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did be sure to leave a like subscribe make sure you subscribe for more videos we are on a roll with subscribers we've gained about five in the past two weeks or so so make sure you guys subscribe and uh comment down below what you think of infinite warfare and cod 4 remastered it's been kevin aberger and i'll see you all next video thank you for watching